unboxing video of the cosplay care package from Pocket Bean. Pocket Bean is a store that centers around inclusive witchcraft and fashion. Everything that Pocket Bean makes, whether it be their headpieces, their jewelry, or any pieces of clothing, are all made with the want to help out other people. The owner of the shop is incredibly nice and is a wonderful person to talk to. The owner of the shop will be at both Hama and KatsuCon, so make sure you take a minute and stop by their shop to see what they're selling for yourself. I received the cosplay care package. That being said, there are also other packages you can choose from, including the empath package, the mental health package, and the trans queer package. It is possible to sponsor a trans queer package for a trans queer youth in need, so make sure you check that out. I'll make sure to link that down below. With all that being said, let's open this. Doesn't it feel like there's anything at the top? So should just say it I really like the packaging. As you can see, it came in like a really nice pumpkin -y thing. Uh, Ooh, there's a lot in here. I think that's all. Let's open. I have um, a little package right now. There's stuff inside of it. I don't care about it. And there's a couple packages here. And a sheet that comes with what's inside of the pieces, inside of the charms, and what they mean and what they give you. Well, we're gonna read this first so we have an idea of what we're talking about. So the sigils are meant to be guidelines and are only as strong as the intent energy put into them. Um, the owner of the shop put as much power into the sigils as they can do to give us a good starting point. The owner also likes to use the sigils as physical reminders and sometimes write them on their body or other places around the room or, or any places they might need uh, extra encouragement or energy. Besides writing sigils with a pen or on paper, you can also draw them in the air, on your food, with ketchup, or even line up sticks in the, on the forest. You can line up sticks in the forest. You can also paint them on fabric and sew them into your cosplay. So if you need a little bit of extra confidence one day during the convention, just paint it on the inside of your cosplay. I think that's really cool. Um, some tips is... Uh, when you draw the sigil, you should repeat the, the phrase and say it with power, with strength, and this is your message to the universe, and it's really important that you say it out loud. If you uh, mess up the sigil, throw a line through it and cancel it. Redraw sigil every three months. So these are all different, like, it just uh, tells you tips and tricks on, the on that one, on that side, and then it has information on the spell pendants, which I assume are these and what's inside of them and what they do. And then this side has the crystals that are inside each of them and what they mean. And it also tells us about the candles that they sell and witch tips. So make sure you look this over when you get your care packages because it has a lot of useful information on it. So let's get to the rest of it. So I got a message from the owner of the shop um, it says, Dear Vaciliating Artemis, thank you so much for promoting this cosplay care package. I hope this package arrives safely and will hopefully see you at home at sending you light and magic pocket bean. Like I said, the owner of this shop is incredibly kind and is just really dedicated to making everything like the best they can. So we're gonna open this little box. So there's more crystals. So we have a large assortment of crystals, so I'll definitely show you those in a minute. So here we have the sigils, and Pocket Bean asked me to show you guys a couple of them. So what I'll do is I'll go get a piece of paper and write them down myself and show them to you. I have paper, it's really cute, it has paper on it, and a uh, uh, marker. And I want to make sure that I'm doing the sigils correctly, so I'm going to look at them and draw them as quickly as I can while following the tips that the owner gave me. Okay, so I drew down three of my favorites from the sig uh, sigil sheet, and I will show them to you really quickly. So the first one is 
I am safe. And I think it's really, I really liked this one because I think it's good to always feel safe. Like, it's nice to always feel safe where you are and not to be like anxious or anything. So that's why I chose that one. The next one is, I am protected from negative energy. Um, I just have been really stressed lately with a bunch of things and um, negative energy is not something I need right now. So I chose that one. And then the last one I chose is I am safe while traveling. And I chose that one because um, I'm going to haul that and I'm traveling all by myself. So it'll be um, a new thing for me. So I'm just going to write a pocket bean on it because I want to. So that was really fun. And I made sure to say it out loud while I was drawing them to really get that power. That is how they suggested I do it. So there's a total of 12 sigils on here. So you get to pick um, which ones you want to use. And I'm sure if you ask them if you're looking for like a certain sigil or a sigil with a certain kind of power, if you ask them, I'm sure they'll create some for you. Alright, and so now we're going to move on to the pendants and the charms. I'm going to show how many are in here. So, in total, there is six different ones. So, we're going to go through each of them. So, this is remembering and self care. I'm going to take it out of its bag and bring it close to the camera so you can really see it. And it's really pretty. I really like it. It's definitely something you could wear with anything. And if I look at the sheath, is the remembering self care and boosting healthy energy engine. And inside of it is baby's breath, mint, and salt. The ingredients of each spell pendant emulate the energy of the spell. So, um,. The owner likes putting spells into a physical form and being able to hold something and feel the energy is wonderful. The act of putting on one of these pendants around your neck and your pocket car, make a bag, edit, is the first step to activating the spell. So, we're going to... So that's the first one, the remembering self care. So the next one is cleansing from hotels and social groups. I'll show you guys when you read the paper. So this one looks like this. And the cleansing of hotel rooms and social groups, which is of course something all of us need when we're at a convention is sage, rose, and lemon. So, I think it's a good combination. We're gonna look at the next one. This one is self-love, and I really like this one. Actually, we're gonna save it for last. We're gonna like that one a lot. <laughs> okay, so this one is energy and focus. This one is energy and focus. Oh, this one's really pretty. I think they're all really gorgeous, but I really like the way this looks. And inside of the energy focus one is pink salt and basil. And then the next one is protection from negative energy. As I said before, when I drew my sigil, my sigil, I um, have been having a rough time, so I definitely need some protection from uh, negative energy, so I'll definitely be wearing this soon. But it comes in this cute little jar. And you can see the multitude of ingredients inside of this spell. And inside of this one is 
Oh, my bad. It's actually called Protection from Negative Protection from Negativity, Sending Assholes and Creeps Away. So we definitely need that in conventions. It is lavender, rose, and salt. Good combination. Okay. And the next one is social energy. For those of us that get a little drained more with social people with for those of us that get a little drained when we're with people, um, this would be a great spell to have. Um, let's see it. Looks like that. And inside of social energy and confidence is the full name, is basil and orange. And so the last one, which is actually my favorite, because um I myself struggle with this often, um, it's self-love, and I like it the, m not the most per se, I really like them all, but I definitely favor this one because it's in the shape of a heart as well, and I just think it's really, really pretty, and I'll show it to you guys, it looks like this. And inside of this one is pink, salt, rose, and orange. And this is definitely one of my favorite ones. And with that, uh, we also get the pocket bean business card. And this is one of the headdresses that they've made. And you also get all of their information. So make sure you screenshot this. screenshot this and uh, look them up. I'll also link them down below as I said previously. And with that, that is everything that comes in the cosplay care pack. Pocket Bean also sells headdresses, candles, clothing, and more. If you're interested, there's also a mystery box which is underneath Magic Mail in their Etsy. So this is the unboxing video for Pocket Bean's uh, cosplay care package and I'll make sure to put these spells with um, different looks of my normal cosplay so you all can see that because these uh, spells are definitely going to help me through uh, tough times and cons and just tough times in real life. Um, I'm really excited that I was able to promote uh, any of Pocket Bean's stuff and I really hope you guys go and check them out. Once again, they'll be at Hallmat and KatsuCon tabling, so go look for them and look at their spells because we all need a little bit of self-love and protection from negativity. And last but not least, I want to thank Pocket Bean for giving me this amazing chance to promote any of their merchandise. All of their merchandise is made with just a lot of integrity and happiness and they're a business that's generally dedicated to trying to like make other people feel better about themselves and just the world in general. So I really hope you give them out a look.